This video describes the View tab in your Medmon E300 corneal topographer. Start by clicking on a single topography, then go up to the View tab and notice four icons will appear. The first one, and one that you'll use least frequently, is the Details tab. And this one allows you to change how you've saved the topography. For instance, if this is actually a right eye and not a left eye, you can change it here and save. If this is a different patient and we've saved the wrong topography into a different patient's file, you can click Change and find the patient uh, whose map this actually belongs to. So this icon, the details, is used least frequently. The one you're going to use most frequently is the image option. And this allows you to view up to four different topographies simultaneously. For instance, a right and left eye. Or in this case, the same topography from the same day, uh, four different images of that eye, and allowing us to view the reproducibility of the maps. We could blow up the image itself by clicking on the collapse button here and allowing us to view them in larger scale. Or again, clicking on the expand to allow for the data section, zone K, and comments to be viewed. Let's go back to a single topography. And then we'll go to the next icon over, the comparison map. And this option is used most frequently in orthokeratology or to compare patient visits over time. For instance, if we take our pre-OrthoK topography, our baseline map, select our post-treatment map, then click on the comparison icon, this allows us to view how the eye has changed over time. The comparison map will be analyzed in great detail in a later video. The next icon, the combination view, allows us to view one single topography multiple different ways. So now that we're, we have two topographies selected, we have to choose one only to allow the combination view to pop up. We can see the same individual topography as an axial map, a tangential map, an elevation map, and the photokeratoscope image. If we would like to change the view of any one of these maps, we could go to Display, click on the title bar of that particular topography, and then alter the appearance here. This function may be used most frequently to expand the photokeratoscope image and look at the quality of the ring reflection. Otherwise, generally under View, you're using the Image option most frequently.